add texture to a substrate, if you want a fairly high level of texture, you can put your gel gloss, either heavy, uh, regular or satin down and you can impress that with sand or gravel, etc. But if you want a, a slightly uh, lower level, binder medium works exactly the same. So all you've got to do is spread that binder over where you want the sanded texture and it's quite a bit, it's quite a bit um, thinner than, you, than your uh, regular mediums. Sprinkle the sand, impress the sand, then that will dry and the, the binder will adhere to that sand and you'll have a lovely surface. You just sprinkle off after you've let that dry uh, for a few hours, you just sprinkle off the excess sand and you're left with a beautiful sanded uh, texture. What's really great is to do this with sprinkles if you like working with glistening stuff, but I know my grandchildren love this. Because the binder medium is so thin it doesn't and it dries clear, it doesn't affect your composition and you can just just put the sprinkles in, the binder dries clear and it's just the sprinkles are adhered quite well. The other thing you could do is if the kids or you like to draw with lines, you could put your binder into an applicator, add the sprinkles and then draw and you'll be end up with just lines of sprinkles where the medium has disappeared.